the first thing you want to do is find the teacher's guide in there. And the teacher's guide has everything you need. It, you'll be very, you could be very intimidated, but don't be. They do a really good job with the with the manual. You'll love it. So, page three lists everything that should be in your box. If you're buying a used system or worried that everything's not included, you'll want to check this against what's in your box. And then you'll want to read this. And it explains everything. It's very good. You'll love it. Maybe I can do um, videos later on it. But to set up your system so you can teach someone to read, you want to go to your lesson sequence on page 35, 36, and 37. Now, I've completed level 1. I'm sending it on to somebody else. But I've set up level 2. And level 2 is the same thing. You can see I have all the lessons in order. And it tells me what part of the system I need to use that lesson. So I've copied this, and I use this to know how many uh, folders I've set up, how many lessons are ready to go, and where my child is progressing. So you copy this from the book, and you put your book safely aside. And now you're ready to set up your learning this system. This is mine from level one. I threw away the first two pages because I was done with it. But you can see I checked it off as I made them. I knew how many I had available to me to use. If I had to color copy cards, I made notes to make sure I, f I did that. I knew by lesson 168 I need to make new color copies, so it really came in handy.